Welcome to Medium Rare episode 22, Extending Primitives. As we always do with hard surface work, we put on the grid and grid snap and the angle snap so we can place things nice and neat. Going to adjust the grid. Here I'm putting on 9 so that we've got 10 separate squares and changing the colour of the stamp to mid grey and up the resolution just to give us a little bit more definition. 3 is good and place and then move cube inner 100, strength 100 then we're going to scale this up using the thumbstick until it's just smaller than the size of the piece and then pinch by grabbing and scaling down by keeping a hold of grip we can then scale any size and ratio that we want based on the size of the grid that we've made this is super handy because we can then make spikes any size that we like but we can do this with any profile let's say a pyramid clay cube pinch pyramid and again that can be any ratio of width to height okay so that's the first one the next one i want to show is a similar thing but much more complex a demonstration that using only the stamps that we have we can make far more complex shapes let's put on mirror scaling up the cube and then grabbing and pulling it along and then doing the same in the vertical and then now that's a nice shape as it is but we can take that even further grab and scale clay cube subtract and there we go we've got a nice machined looking edge using the combination of these you can make lots and lots of extended primitives i find myself using these an awful lot i hope this is useful to you and i'll speak to you next time thanks for listening and don't forget to subscribe